Another important test that's becoming more and more important as we learn more and more about reflux is known as the electrogastrogram, or what we call the EGG for short. In this test, three electrodes will be placed on your abdomen, on the left, mid, and right portions of your upper abdomen, and you'll be asked to sit still for approximately 10 minutes. After this 10 minute baseline period, you'll be asked for five minutes to drink water until you feel you are completely full. And then for the next 30 minutes, the equipment will monitor the contraction of your stomach. What we're looking for specifically here are disorders in the contraction or the motility of your stomach. And we can call these different motility disorders either slow stomach emptying or slow stomach contraction, known as bradygastria, fast stomach contraction, known as tachygastria, a mixture of the two, which we'll call mixed, or the one that we're really concerned about is something that we call functional outlet obstruction, which means that even though your stomach contracts normally, it cannot contract well enough it's contracting against a closed pyloric sphincter. And this causes your gastric contents to back up and will actually make your reflux worse. So when we consider correcting reflux, we wanna make sure that the patients or that the people who have the reflux do not have this obstructive change because we'd wanna fix that first so as to not make them worse once we fix the reflux.